Hello and welcome to the month of March totem animal medicine totem animal message. I'll get it out right. <laughs> I hope you've had a great um, month last month. Uh, this month seems to be quite a, um, a jam-packed month actually. Um, working with the animal medicine cards, I love it because I get a little bit of a, a spiritual connotation to what is coming also seeing what um what's going on in the consciousness so i think um you know when you have a, a, a bit of awareness about you it really does bring in the energy of that particular animal that's working with us so this month we had the uh, the weasel um i'll show you the card which is this one here the weasel card so the weasel is actually working with us a lot this month and you know the weasel's very stealthy it's got a lot of energy um and uh, you know it, it's a smaller animal but it actually has um a keen sharpness to its um, um auric field so it can kind of like weave its way through places it can be where it needs to be um it's got very good hearing and also very good eyesight so it's a very intelligent for a smaller creature uh, you know in the animal kingdom it's actually quite uh versatile and is in touch so what the month of uh, march is saying here is that this is the month of being a little bit more sharp being a little bit more aware um, when the weasel comes into um, the month's reading it's also reminding you of um, it will help you or the ability to kind of like tap in uh, into the unknown so the weasel has this amazing ability to be able to see know and feel what's actually going on and on another level we could look at that and say it's a very intuitive animal so when the weasel steps in like it has um for this month which is march so we have had already had you know gone through the last two months uh, i think january was a little bit slower than february but march could be the month where everything comes to light um where energy starts to move forward where clarity starts to come in where you might go all of a sudden bang i know where i'm going um, I have much more uh, clearer direction now than what I did in the month of January, let's say. Um, so you may find that the weasel energy is just purely working with you, getting back in touch with those little finer skills that you have um, as a spiritual being. So as um, let's say your intuition, your hearing may become uh, more astute, your eyesight maybe, you may see things more clearly than what you have the last few months or even even longer so when the weasel comes in it's reminding you that you have a, a beautiful abilities um, to tap back into that can help you to navigate through not only this month but throughout the year and um, you know again never underestimate a small little creature like the weasel because um, its abilities are plentiful in its small little package so a little bit like yourself maybe this is the month where you can you know allow yourself to see clearly uh, you may find that your intuition's a little bit more open um, and that you know just things are coming to light it's almost like the weasel always it's like a truth speaker or a truth or you know brings the truth to the surface so you may find that this animal coming into this month has reminded us all that there may be things that we need to see um, and we may need to use our intuition or our, um, our skills like skill set like this to kind of like see what we need to see so it's going to be a busier month i feel the month of um, march with uh, the weasel card coming in means there's a lot to get done and you know because of its high energy uh, it definitely has this amazing energy to kind of like get things done so that's a really good sign for all of us in the human um, side of things because that means potentially we will also come into a month where we will get things physically done a lot more easier um, energetically as well you may find that um, the energy around you becomes a lot easier to navigate through and just that clarity and I, and I love when you know um, like the weasel it brings uh, to the forefront the important things that are you know that we may need to work with more and that can mean working with the intuition working with hearing it you know using our hearing and our sight a lot more um, and I hope this month for all of you that it is a month that is moving forward quicker um, with a lot more clarity um, you know every month we we will always encounter certain things like you know stops and starts delays but I guess it's it's more how we navigate through that and having that awareness of um, okay well this month it could be it I guess I, I liken the animal medicine cards 
very similar to astrology but on a totally different scale you know um, astrology is the planets um, the animal kingdom is a completely different ball game but what I'm trying to say here is that we can always you know open up from a message that we receive from whether it be astrology or whether it be numerology whether it be the animal medicine cards but knowing and understanding the energy and the vibration that is flowing at that time helps you to be able to go okay this is what i need to do this month this is where i need to be this is what i need to you know this is the dot, dots and i need to cross and tick the dots here for certain things so i would see the month of march as being a very active month especially with the weasel coming in um but also a very insightful month um so again when i say insightful it also means it's not just going to be, oh, because the, the, the weasels come in. It's also going to come down to you as an individual to open up to what what else can you open up to? What else can you bring into your um, awareness, soul's awareness? And just by doing those little things and being aware that it can be, you know, it, it, it can really help you to get to that next stage, that next level if you are wanting to go to higher levels and, and really obtain some beautiful things, you know, um, it will be a busy time. That's that's the gist of what I'm feeling when I connect with the, the weasel card this month. And, you know, it's not a bad thing because, you know, we do have to start moving forward. We, we do have to start getting things in, into play because being the month of March, we're now three uh, months into the year. And before we know it, it's going to go very quickly. So if you are planning, you know, to, um, let's say, change your career or, or, you know, pick up your career in some way, do something more and become a bit better at what you're doing or try something new, this may be the month that would be really good with that, knowing that the energy, the energy will be around for you to be able to access. And, um, you know, remembering the weasel is maybe only a small little creature, but it achieves a lot. And, um, you know, it, it's amazing, actually, when you, you go a little, delve a little bit deeper into what the weasel's abilities are. And actually, in, in the, the medicine um, cards that I'm using, uh, and I have been using for many years, is, uh, you know, the ex, you know, understanding how it used to work with the tribes and, um, and understanding how it, it's, it's different qualities. So it's got so many different qualities, as people do, um, that, you know, uh, really make it unique. And, um, but yeah, so it, I, when I look at the, the weasel card, it reminds me of what we have in Australia, ferrets. And, fe and I guess they may be from the same family, I'm not quite sure, to be honest, but a ferret, you know, if, you, if, if you've ever owned a ferret, it is amazing how quick and agile it is and how it can be in one place one moment and next minute somewhere else. But it doesn't forget where to go back. And I guess it's like us in a lot of ways. If we remember what we've got to do, instead of just, you know, racing ahead and not getting it done, we can then come back and go, oh, hang on, that's right, I was doing this at this moment, so let's go back, complete that, and then move forward. So it's a really it's a really progressive month, the month of March, and I think, you know, for all of us, we can all kind of like gravitate to that energy and allow that energy to work for us on whatever level, whether it be in your family, uh, personal life, whether it be your career or work, or even out in your community. So um, it'd be interesting to see, and um, please feel free to leave comments and tell me how your month was uh, for the month of March. But, um, you know, I always consider, you know, even remotely you know, tapping into the animal's um, energy and knowing its little ways of doing things, it can really, really do, really do a lot of um, uh, good just to understand it. And uh, the weasel we don't have in Australia, we don't, um, that's why I was saying we have more like um, the ferret. Uh, it may be the same family, just similar energy um, and agility, you know, it's amazing. But um, yeah, it's, it's just nice to be able to connect with those animals and uh, know their abilities and know that maybe for the month of this month of March, we can be tapping into that and um, really connecting on different levels for our own self as in a spiritual self. 
So um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please feel free to subscribe. Um, I will be doing a lot more, not just in the animal medicine, uh, working with the animal medicine cards, but I also have other things on my channel. Um, I will be doing a lot more with you in the very near future. And um, I'm so looking forward to um, reconnecting for the month of oh, the March, April. Wow. So the month and the year is going to go very quick, everyone. So wherever you are in the world, whatever you are doing, may you have peace. And may you find the month of March a very busy, productive and happy month. One that you're happy to do everything that needs to get done. Until next month, I will see you then. Thank you, everyone.